Hello, it is me. Um, welcome to my channel again. Uh, so if you saw my last video, you knew that I did a haul. Um, I did talk about the active, active Wow 24 Care product. Is that charcoal? Um, I'm gonna test it out. So first, you need a wet toothbrush. So the instructions are simple. You have a wet toothbrush. Oh my god, I just dumped a bunch of product everywhere. Dip it into a powder. A little goes a long way. Brush teeth for one to two minutes. Rinse thoroughly. Spit close to the drain with water running. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay. Oof. So I feel like that is a lot. There's like still a ton of product. Like so much. Okay. Look on your real quick. Oh no, it's literally like, you know when you brush your teeth and like it gets everywhere, like, oh, oh my god. Okay, hair is now, I'm gonna use my shower actually because <laughs> I don't want to ruin my sink. Oh my, it literally stained my hand. Oh, it's literally like black. Ugh. Oh my god, I do not know how to gurgle. Ugh. There's like a little bit of black, like, I don't know if you can see. I'm going to use my mirror real quick. Like a little bit of black, like right here. Honestly, though, oh, it feels like, oh, there's my unfinished bathroom. It feels really like dry. Uh, you can't see very well. It feels really like charcoal-y. Honestly though, like it took everything off my teeth. Like they are noticeably whiter, but I don't know if that's because like the pure black automatically is going to make it look whiter. So um, I'm going to keep using it and see if we can get some more reviews going. Now I'm going to review my uh, makeup. I mean, my teeth are visibly like whiter because I always struggle with like yellow teeth my whole life. Um, fat, acne, yellow teeth. I have it all triple threat. Watch out, bitches. Um, so now we're going to go into the makeup. <sighs> I am your not beauty guru, beauty guru. So as I showed before my last video, I have like this little like create the look type thing. And honestly, I kind of want to like try and tackle them. Um, I am really digging like this gold number. So there's the instructions on how to do it in case. Oh my God. In case you're wondering, I don't actually know if this hand thing works. I saw a bunch of other people do it. Um, so oh, this is a nightmare. First, we're going to prep the face with the products I got, which is like the matte elf primer putty stuff. My elf concealer. I'm really digging like the budget friendly vegan amazing products that e.l.f. is and are, I don't know. Um, then I have my Becca foundation that I'm gonna do. Um, I'm not sure if I wanna do like the putty or if I wanna do the stick. So I don't know, we'll get to that stuff later. So first I'm going to start it with the matte putty primer. Um, I don't have anything to do primer with yet. So we're just gonna go in with my hands cause you know, I'm a bitty guru. Oh my god, I forgot how... I really don't know how much to use, so... That fe oh! This feels like the right amount. Honestly, I'm just using, like, my freaking phone. Which one? Okay, I'm gonna use the Becca mirror. Because that shit was fire. Oh, such a good mirror. So I'm just gonna like dab some there. Oh, already I know I made a mistake. I look like. <sighs> oh my god. Okay. I look like SpongeBob on that episode where they go to the beach and like do the stuff on their nose. <sighs> okay, we're just gonna like rub it in. Oh supposed to like blend into your skin <laughs> um so that's awesome 
Also, a uh, shout out to Kayla, my little sister, who taught me how to say micel micellar. 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 <laughs> I still, oh my gosh. She watched my video and like sent me a video, um, like a voice clip saying micellar. My my cellar. My cellar. <laughs> That's Brian saying my cellar and oh Brian, I forgot how to open my wipes. Broke my wipes last video, so I'm gonna wipe my hand off and like as you can see, like it is just I put way too much of this product on. Brian, I can't open my wipes. Why? I don't remember how what you said. You said push down and up, but it's not opening. I am helpless. So I'm going to chat. Sorry. I'm going to check in my mirror. Okay, honestly, not that bad. Oops, sorry. I'm blocking my shoes. Where's the light? They're right here. You want to say hi? Mm. Yeah, I'm here. Look at this lighting, though. So my bathroom's ghetto, and I have these, like, Christmas lights hanging. And it gives me, like, a good, nice glow. Wow, right this... What? I don't remember how I did this. This putty stuff? Babe, look at my teeth from that stuff. Mm -hmm. Like you dipped it in there. It's crazy. Wow, okay. Like I said last time like that my skin felt tacky from it. Like it still feels tacky, but it's not as like, babe, this is the look I'm gonna attempt. I believe you. <laughs> Someone does. <laughs> I'm very supportive. My cellar? Is it my cellar? My cellar? My cellar? Gosh dang it, I already forgot how to say it. Brian, how do you say it? What? How do you say it? My cellar. My cellar. It literally is, says like M I and then cellar. Like literally is my cellar. I'm just so. Ah, I'm so dumb. Okay. So I'm just gonna. Okay, actually. I'm gonna like. God, I'm so unorganized. In Tana Mojo status, I am balancing my phone on the back of some beauty mask I don't use. So we're just gonna like move you here. Um, I never, like, I still don't know if concealer or foundation goes first. Um, I do concealer and then foundation. So if that's wrong, let me know in the comments below. It probably is. Oh no, babe! Brian? I really don't know what I'm doing. My sister said with the foundation thingy that's like really brown, I should like contour with it. Joke's on her, I don't know how to contour. <laughs> Brian? Brian? What? Can you hit me my pink makeup case? I need my concealer brush. Okay. Not bad. Thank you. This is my like makeup case. Okay. Oh my god, this case. It's like a caboodle case that I've had for a very long time. I just need my foundation brush so I can smooth this shit out because don't judge me I don't know how to use a booty blender like I've tried to use it I don't think I use like a good quality one because I just left it all streaky and weird but like I said I'm your not beauty guru beauty guru So yeah, once I like just, God, it's all streaky. I don't know how to fix this. <sighs> okay, maybe this is not my color now that I'm like looking at it. Or I just did way too much, which that probably is what happened. It is so streaky. Okay, so I guess I'm just gonna like, oh, that helped, yeah, okay. I'm just gonna like rub it, I guess. Work it in with my hands. That putty stuff though is like, I don't know. 
it's almost like making it kind of like patchy in some spots like I don't know if you can see that okay. oh my gosh this it's gonna take forever like my nose is kind of like coming off Oh, I want to cry. <laughs> hey. Now, wait, do you, babe, do you know if you contour before or after foundation? I have never done makeup in my life. <laughs> I don't know either. I almost dropped my little thing. Well, figure it out as we go. I forgot to get my little eyebrow thing here's that I don't actually know how to do my brows either <laughs> okay so I'm just gonna go on with the foundation because I feel like that's next and then I guess we'll figure out contouring later I don't okay so I'm just gonna little bit there babe are you are you playing a video yeah why wow you don't want to listen to me that's not why you should watch my video and get me some views okay oh it does smell good okay it smells kind of like vanilla coconutty like tropical which I already said but like it also smells like paint thinner Get that, get that fat neck. We're gonna figure out how to contour that shit at another time. If you guys have any like contour videos that you like, mmm, something poked me. Hook a girl up. I'm just kind of like, look at the wrist. This brush is kind of like sharp. That makes, that probably doesn't make any sense, but like, oh, I'm just trying to like get it mostly blended. I don't know if it's like the brush that smells like chemicals or. Okay, I'm going to have to invest in a beauty blender because my shit is streaky. Oh my gosh, I, I don't know if it's like this lighting, but I look like a ghost. <laughs> I'm just gonna like, go in, use my hands, fix this freaking freakiness. I don't know if it's cause the primer, or if it's just my lack of skill. Honestly, it's probably the latter, but it just looks weird. Maybe it's just the camera or the lighting. I don't know. So that is done. I'm going to take, oh my God, I'm going to take this brownish or this is like that orange one a little bit. I'm going to try and contour, I guess, but I'm going to use my fingers because I don't have a beauty blender, nor do I know how to use one. I see people do this, right? The three. A little bit more. Let's define this double chin, shall we? And then, I don't know, do you do it like here? I feel like that's right. And then, I don't know, that's going to be it, I guess, because I don't really know where else I'm supposed to go to her. My sister, Kaylin, will probably tell me after this video. She's the one that recommended the contour instead of, like, throwing it away. So, thanks, Kaylin. Shout out. Link her channel below. <laughs> oh, yeah, Kaylin. If you have a YouTube channel, Kaylin, I'll hook it up. I don't really have anything to give you, but... Oh, no. Okay. 
contouring is not my thing. I may be committing a hate crime with my brown face. Okay, well, I won't just boom. Okay, there we go. Gosh, this is making me more mad. Like, it's like you're on a train that's wrecking and like you know it's wrecking and you can't really do anything because like you're not a conductor. But in this case, I am the conductor and it's just... <laughs> now I just look dirty. Not like I'm doing anything. I I lost my micellar wipe and I shut the wipes. Right. Okay. Ugh. So I bought these today and like the little open tag broke off. And Brian taught me how to open it. But I already forgot. I'm about to break these open. I literally cannot figure this out. Ah! Oh my god. I am a ditz. <sighs> okay, wait. Hold up. Maybe it's not too bad. Or maybe it's worse. I don't know. So now we're gonna go in for the eyes. Here is the look we're creating, gives us step by step. Okay, first step, sweep past ports and pineapples into crease. That sounds like an easy task. Do I use the blending eye brush? Okay, we're just gonna use the eyeshadow brush. Oh my God, sweep past port and pineapples into crease. That is like such a simple thing, but I'm struggling. Also, I don't know which one's which. I guess it's if I'm holding it this way. Island Queen. Wait, oh my God. Or is it this way? Yum, yum. Coconut. Your girl messed up. I, I don't know if this one is the Passports and Pineapples or if this one is the Passports and Pineapples. Okay, let's take a look at it. So it's like that brown color. And then we're going to smudge Tootie Cutie into the outer lid. Okay, wait. Because it's a really dark color, it has to be that brown. Okay, okay, so that's Tootie Cutie. Which means, if that's Tootie Cutie, then that's Pineapple Cooler. That one is Island Queen. This is, this, okay. <laughs> this is Pineapple Passport, we're gonna take that color. Oh my God, I am so sorry. Wait, I forgot what, it, sweep it into the crease. That's such a simple task, but <sighs> let's go. I feel like that's not a sweep. So now I'm gonna take my blending brush because that's not a sweep. Okay, a little more subtle. I have hooded eyelids, so it's gonna be a little ugh. Okay, it has been swept. Look, I mean, looks exactly like it. Number two, smoke, smoke tootie cutie into the outer lid and smudge into the lower lash line. Okay, this one is a smudge brush, so I'm assuming we're gonna smudge that shit. So we're gonna take tootie cutie. I wonder if I can like flip this. I don't really know what smoking is. So we're just gonna apply it here to the lower lash line. Am I doing this right? Uh, 
Oh no, I'm not. That went way too far out. Lower, lower. How far do I go in? Okay, they went pretty far. Bruh. Oh my gosh, I just like jammed it into my eye. Okay, this looks way better, this other eye. This isn't, this is a nightmare. Like literally, I don't know what I did. Next, press sparkling pineapple onto the lid. Okay, so it's this middle one. Press it, okay. Holy schnokies, that is, well, pigmented AF. It's kind of creamy. And then what else? Onto the lid. Okay, so that's it. We have pressed it <laughs> onto the lid. Smudge Island Queen into the lower lash line, which is, oh gosh. Where is that smudger? So this one is the Island Queen. That, like. Wait, I forgot what it said already. What did I do? Smudge it into the lower lash line. Oh my god. The whole... Yeah. Okay, let's go. Let's get... Oh! Let's get it. Okay. Y'all, this is so bad. Brian, I do not have a future in makeup. Sure you do. No, oh my god, this is so bad. Is there a trick to apply this shirt? Okay, lower lash line, done. <laughs> Step five, highlight the inner corner with Tutti Cutti. Bruh, 2D Cutie was the one we did on the outer lid. That really dark color. I'm supposed to highlight it. I think they meant yum yum. Because it's like that white color. So we're gonna We're gonna go back in with our detailing brush with yum yum, because I think that's the color they were actually talking about. Yeah, they were talking about yum yum. I don't even know if I'm using the right brush. I'm just gonna. Oh yeah, that is what they were talking about. That is good. Well, oh my gosh, I'm gonna take my wipe, fix this eye. I, I don't even know what to do, honestly. Oh, I guess that. Well, that. Oh my god, I have like my concealer all messed up. Okay, well, that's that. Now, I'm gonna do my mascara. I'm using the Artistry Studio 3 in 1. It's like a lash brushing one. Lash brushing. Here's the look. 
and put you in the light. Not perfect, but guess what? I tried. And, oh my God, that gold is just... But this stuff, you, it has like... Extends so you're supposed to extend it all the way first, and it's got like those fibers in it, which I like because it really boosts my lashes. My sister hates it though because she feels like she has like one eyelash because it goes on so thick. So then, once you get your first coat, scrunch it in, and go back over. Oh shoot, I forgot to put my base on. Okay. If I knew how to do eyeliner, I feel like it would make it just look a little bit better. But we get what we get, don't we? Can't have what we want all the time. I can't get over my teeth. I'm going to do my eyebrows. I don't actually know how to do my eyebrows, so we're going to do what I think I'm doing, which is, it's going to get so much shit. So I just take the pencil part of it. I'm using the NYX Professional Makeup brush thingy. I just go like, boom, get some product on my brows, right? And then, because like I said, not a beauty guru, beauty guru. I take the end, which has like this like glaze stuff, but it's like way too brown for my brows so i take my makeup wipe that i lost and i like wipe the stuff off kind of like i do one a once through like you could see how much product came off and then i just kind of there's like a little bit of product on here i just kind of like brush it on and i also feather out like the little product i did put on it so it kind of looks a little better I literally do not know how to do my brows. So if you have any ease, I've literally tried to follow like every tutorial in the book too. Like I cannot follow eyebrow tutorials. I accidentally shaved, oh my God, I forgot to blend that, shaved part of my eyebrow one time because they were like, oh yeah, you just need to tweeze, to tweeze your brows. And I don't know how to tweeze. Here, I'm gonna show you what it looks like with this product stuff. It's like really dark. Oh, hold up. Girl, that ain't that. Oh, fuck. Yeah, it's bad. Like, this one's clearly. Oh my god, I forgot I tried. God, do I. I need to fix my lights. Okay, this is a 30 minute video. Oh my god. So that's done. I'm gonna do this. I really liked it actually. I'm just gonna like zoop. Oh, zoop. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, that shit smells so good. I forgot how pink it is. Gee, mini Christmas. It literally is so buttery smooth. look is a mess. I am next going to take, gosh darn it, that was loud. Oh, that's not shut. I have my Milani Rose Glow. I am taking the color Pearl and I am going to, where did it go? I am going to use my powder brush. I'm gonna take a little bit of this white color and I'll like dust it here. I wanna use the jelly one, but my boyfriend gets mad at me if I glow too much because I am a hoe for glowing. I also say I am a hoe for way too much. So I'm gonna take a little bit on my hand and I'm gonna like do the bro. Oh my God, I put way too much there. But you know what, We like I said before, we like a glowy hoe. Oh, I forgot to not use the freaking video camera light thingy because it does not come out right. There you go. Now we're going to do our lips. 
My sister said she actually liked the new thing on me, so we're just gonna try and complete the look, I guess, so. When I tried to take the stuff off before, it would not come off. I guess we're overlining today. This texture though, is like so buttery smooth. But I kid you not, I went through three wipes trying to get this off. look we're doing today from this no well, from this to this to this I'll post some pictures at the end 